Alright people, we're back. This is me, Alexandra04, and we're playing a new game called The House of Da Vinci. This game, believe it or not, has got really positive reviews and quite a good rating in at the App Store. So basically it's a more of a puzzle game where then there's more of like a puzzle inside of a puzzle and a key inside of a key, sort of like. Basic plot is that Leonardo da Vinci, I assume that you all know him, he was a really good genius and um, in this game he has actually disappeared for some apparent reason that we don't know yet. And I'm already really excited of playing this game. Now let's start shall we? Florence 1506. Nice. It's already evening. Oh, never realized it. Switch the screen to look around. Alright. Double tap on the card. See. Scroll. Scroll. Hmm. Item found. Interesting. I wonder who wrote this letter and what's it about. Let's see, shall we? Ooh, let's read it. Dear friend, I am sending this message to you through our trustworthy messenger, as events of recent days do not allow me to meet you personally. Really? For what apparent reason? For a long time, I have been working on an extraordinary invention. It is so significant that it goes beyond everything I created before. On the one hand, the machine fills me with pride, but I am also fearful lest the invention fall into the wrong hands. This is the reason why the entrances to my house are well secured. Okay, that seems reasonable enough. This is my plea to you. Gain entry to my library where you will learn more. In the mailbox you will find my new optical invention which I have named the Oculi Infinitum. I know you well and I am convinced that you are very gifted. I am sure you will discover how to use it. Sign LD aka Leonardo da Vinci. <coughs> Sorry. So as you can see the background music and the Background effects are like so good that you, even if you play it, it seems it's sorry, it seems real and even feels real, like as if you were there in real life during the Renaissance status. I know this place is an entrance to the master's house used by servants. Oh great, we're gonna have to like use the servants' entrance. Oh well, some things are just better than nothing. The mechanism must be a bell. Looks like its upper part can be done. Okay. Small metal object, okay. It seems that I found one part of a key. I must find the other part, obviously. Items marked with a plus must be combined with the other object to complete them. Very well. Let's check the mailbox. A key part. Now let's combine these. And voila! Key holes here and that's the Oculi Infinitum. Looks more of like a lens. So people have you to notice one thing that um, as you can see the symbol on this lens looks more of like the symbol of the element of air. What are your views about this? Post your comments down below. This must be the Oculus Infinitum Leonardo mentioned in his letter. Where can I test it? That's a good question. So I have the lens. Ooh, nice feature. Amazing! The master succeeded in creating a lens which makes it possible to see inside any mechanism. This would be a very useful device. Obviously, why wouldn't? Leonardo surely is one hell of a genius. A renaissance genius, that is. 
It's like you're seeing a x-ray of any machine that is in this case. The rubble from the blast must even have hit the master's house. I hope he was not injured. Man, guys, that was totally messed up. I don't know what happened. Okay, I don't know how you pronounce it. Badia Fiorentina. Post your um, pronunciation down below, okay? Um, let's just get it. For now. Alright, of course we can't turn back. Even if we did, we would that guy, whoever it was, my fault was, and maybe even ambushes. So, as you can see, this is practically the first chapter of this game, and I'm already beginning to love it. So, thank you for watching this. I'll see you guys in the next one. By opening this door, the new, the real story begins. See you guys later.